If you don't know what exactly is the ETO like process, like a terminology, this video is for you guys. The purpose of that video and agenda is to explain what is the behind of this the abbreviature, to use example to get better understanding and every one of you that watching this video to get really basic and good knowledge about what is the ETO process and in the last on the last uh, place we'll uh, share with you who usually do this process if you like this video if you want to be part of our community don't wait click on the subscriber button and not forget to click on bell button to smash it let's start it what exactly etl etl coming from extract transform and load what exactly this mean? We get the data from different places, transform the data in information and load in good place that analysts and management part could use and could create a reports and take decisions. To get better understanding after we represent the basic description of this terminology, I will give you one real world example and uh, for example we want to cook a pizza what we need to cook a pizza we want to cook really delicious pizza and usual to, to do that you should buy your ingredients for your pizza your pro for pro the products for your pizza from different places because usually in the supermarket it's not the best quality products that you could buy and to accept in our example that for our pizza to have really delicious pizza the best pizza we could buy our salami for example close to us and to go and to go for a walk and the buy it uh, the mozzarella because the shop it's not so close to us we could use the public transport uh, for tomatoes that we we will use uh, they uh, could be in a place that we can, cannot reach with the public transport, we should use our car. And idea here is that we could reach our ingredients, our products, uh, from different way. This is the key part for, for extract part. Because to extract the data and get the whole data that you need, usually you cannot get it only from one place to create a really good report you should reach your data from different places from different sources it's the same like for the really good pizza what is the second step when we have the whole that we need to cook really nice pizza we should prepare our products to cut the salami uh, and so on and put in order that we need to have good pizza, delicious pizza and go across the whole step that transform our products, our ingredients to a pizza. This is the transform part. From the data, you transform it, clean it, remove the duplicates and so on. And from the data, then you could reach the information. And the last part, it's our example with the pizza, with the pizza cooking. It's to put our pizza and bake it. it. That is the walled part. It's already walled. When we have our pizza, when it's it's cooked, uh, we could start to eat it. it. That is the consummation. That is uh, uh, from data world example it's a step that we already wrote our data in really good place like data warehouse we could e explain in separate video and in this place we already wrote information and from this information the data analysts and management part could take a decisions who usually do this job who actually get the data, transform it, it and load it in, in a good place. In last years, these are the data engineers. Before years, 
most of the companies named named these developers ETL developers but because this work it's complex like a work for this reason now you need to be engineer to do that and yeah and data engineers uh, do that at the moment in the teams if you like this video click on the like button thank you for the watching and we will see you in the next video